Now, all of that seems well and good, but I actually want to make this even easier so that I can stroke paths without thinking about it and creating all those layers every single time. That's going to be the beauty of using an action. So I'm going to go ahead and create a new action <coughs> called uh, straight stitch. Now the straight stitch is just going to run uh, uh, the stitch along whatever path is currently selected. The way we're going to do that is just go uh, with it recording. We can just go to layers, create a new layer. We'll rename the layer um, uh, straight stitch alpha. Make another new layer. Let's see. Called straight stitch. Uh, stitch. And one more called straight stitch holes. And uh, now we'll just go and select our different tool presets and do our business. So uh, straight stitch alpha, we can start there. We'll select the straight stitch alpha layer, paths, stroke path, stroke sub path, sorry. And um, with the brush, go. Now we go back here, we select the stitch layer, go back to paths, uh, with the brush tool selected, select uh, straight stitch stitches, stroke subpath, go, and lastly, straight stitch holes, select the layer, and then do stroke subpath with the brush. We'll go back to our layers, select the alpha layer, Set its uh, lock its opacity, flood it white, duplicate it, drag the other one up here, hide it, call it straight stitch alpha two, and that should be looking pretty good. And we can actually merge the stitch and its alpha beneath it, and there we go. We can actually even take those three layers and group them, call it our stitch. Stop recording. Now let's find out if that worked. So there are a couple things we need to do to make this work. I just tried it a couple times and found a couple problems. First thing is we need to make sure that uh, select brush is in the action. So I just recorded and then selected a brush. Um, and then also it's not going to work right. Uh, if these layers all exist already, so I'll have to delete those. But now, with this path selected, we should be able to just run this uh, little program. Click OK if it asks us anything. And we can just stop. There we go. Nope, just delete that. And there we go. That's created our um, the layers, all the layers that we need. And um, I think you could figure out pretty quickly how that could be useful. Enjoy.